This is Winton's chipless cutoff machine intended to uh, cut tubing. Uh, normally this machine works with a uh, payoff, a spool of uh, tubing. Horizontal spool feeds into the machine. The machine straightens the uh, tubing and then proceeds to uh, push it under a powered straightener into a cut head, which then chiplessly uh, cuts, off the, uh, cuts off the tubing. And then the tubing is unloaded. There's an uh, electrical box for all electrical controls. There's a keypad on display um, for uh, numeric uh, input of data, such as part cut length, and also um, number of pieces to cut. You can program the part cut length in either millimeters or inches. There's an e-stop for safe machine operation. Located on the uh, right side of the electrical box is a uh, main power disconnect switch. You can put a padlock on that switch um, in the event that uh, for maintenance uh, operation. There's a uh, large yellow guard on top of the machine that uh, um, sheds all the uh, moving parts inside, has an electrical interlock uh, to prevent the machine from moving or prevent the cut head from rotating um, if the guard is in the up position. Inside the machine, there's a uh, powered servo-driven straightener. There's an in-feed guide, a material low switch to detect when the uh, material is not present. A series of uh, straightener rolls used to uh, straighten the tubing and also power it into the, uh, the cut head. Each roll is um, uh, changed out by removing the thumb screw and then uh, uh, replacing the new uh, uh, roll on there and then putting the thumb screw back in place. There's also an encoder on the uh, powered straightener that tracks, precisionally tracks the amount of material that's being moved through the uh, straightener during a, a cutting operation. The cut head, it's um, pneumatically powered, has um, an AC motor down below that rotates the cut head around the tubing as the tubing is being cut. Of course, the material is static and the cut head rotates about, a, uh, um, about the tubing itself. There's a forward clamp assembly that holds material in place, in part, um, during the uh, cutting operation. And also to the right of that, there's an unload mechanism that uh, gets the cut tube out of the way in uh, preparation for the next tube that's being uh, powered through and uh, going to be cut off shortly by the cut head. In the, uh, the middle back here, you can see a guard interlock switch, and that's used to uh, detect the presence of the uh, uh, top guard, uh, whether it's in the up or down position. And uh, in the up position, the cut head cannot rotate. Machine requires uh, 80 psi shop air, clean shop air. It also uh, runs on uh, AC, generally uh, 220 volt AC is the uh, preferred voltage.